Welcome to teambuilding.com's guide to virtual team building activities. In this video, you'll learn seven activities to engage remote teams and help work from home coworkers get to know each other. Virtual team building activities are important because remote coworkers have fewer chances to connect and interact casually with peers. These tips can fight loneliness, boost camaraderie, and help coworkers collaborate better in online offices. Here are some ideas. Activity number one, lightning scavenger hunts. Lightning scavenger hunts are one of our all time favorite online team building activities. In this twist on the go get it game, a game leader calls out objects one by one. Players race around their homes to be the first person to grab the item and show it on screen. This game is a fantastic energizer that gets team members up and moving instead of sitting and staring at a screen. You might shout out prompts like, First one to show me a spatula wins a point or show me something you would use to fight mummies. Have a few folks share about the items they've brought back. Feel free to give bonus points for extra interesting or funny finds. Activity number two, virtual team building bingo. Virtual team building bingo is one of the best online social games. In this version of the classic game, instead of marking off numbers or pictures, players look for descriptions that fit their code workers. To play the game, send participants links to a bingo board and split the group into breakout rooms. Within those mini groups, team members will chat and reveal which squares most sound like them. The first player or team to mark all five consecutive squares wins the round. This game is ideal for revealing fun and surprising facts that might not come up during normal work conversation. Google teambuilding.com bingo for free bingo boards you can use for your game. Activity number three, Huda Baby. If you'd love to see your coworkers in their kindergarten hamburger Halloween costume, this game is right up your alley. To prepare for this activity, employees will send childhood photos of themselves to the host. Then the leader will pop the pictures onto a meeting screen share or a Slack channel and team members will guess which baby face belongs to which teammate. Then the photo's owner can tell stories about the picture and explain its context. This game is great for learning basic facts about coworkers like hometown, family, and favorite memories. Not to mention, nostalgia does wonders for team bonding. Activity number four, virtual campfire. Virtual campfires are a great way to build camaraderie in remote offices. In these events, teammates gather to tell stories, sing songs, and bond just like they would at summer camp or a camping trip. For the full effect, share a video of a burning bonfire on screen and send guests s'mores ingredients to assemble and enjoy on camera. For more ideas, Google teambuilding.com virtual campfire. Activity number five, this, that, or another thing. You may be familiar with the game This or That, where you have to choose between two related options like summer or winter or chocolate or vanilla. This, that, or another thing takes the game to another level by offering an other option for each question. You can use your video conferencing software's chat box or poll polling feature to let teammates choose between the three. If anyone answers another thing, then the game shifts to 20 questions to figure out that player's preference. For example, if the prompt is cats, dogs, or another thing, questions might be, is it a common pet? Is it a reptile or can it fit into my pocket? This game can spark fun discussion and is a great get to know you activity. Activity number six, Virtual Werewolf. Werewolf is a game of strategy. In this role playing activity, werewolves are eating villagers and each player has a part to play in trying to figure out the werewolf's identity. For example, the medic can save the werewolf's victim, the seer can ask the moderator whether a character is the werewolf, and the villagers vote. The werewolf picks players to eat, and if they last until the final two players, they win the game. The aim of this game is to analyze the outcome of every round and decide who is most likely to be the werewolf. For full game rules, you can Google teambuilding.com werewolf rules. Activity number seven, something in common. Something in common is a fan favorite icebreaker game. The point of this exercise is to split the group into small teams of three to five and challenge each team to find a trait everyone shares. When playing virtually, use breakout rooms to make teams. 
You can play a couple of rounds and randomize the room so participants get to find common ground with different teammates. In this game, the more unusual the link, the better. Everyone wearing glasses is okay, but everyone having grandmas who were in rock bands is much better. Voila! Now you know how to run engaging remote team building activities that bring employees closer and increase the sense of belonging in online offices. Want more tips? Google teambuilding.com virtual team building activities for even more ideas. If you found this video helpful, hit like and share to see more like it. Then subscribe to get notified when we post our next one. Question for the comments. What was the best virtual team building activity you ever did with a team? See you next time.